we're going to solve this one right here. So uh, first thing I'm going to do is subtract 25 from both sides to get that x squared all alone. I notice if I do that, I have x squared is less than negative 25. So before we uh, try and square root anything or do anything further, let's just think about what this is saying. I'm going to square a number, and it's going to be less than negative 25. Well, I know that when I square uh, real numbers, they're always positive. So this actually can never happen. So right here, I can say no real solution. And uh, if I really want to graph it, it's just a number line without anything marked on it.